we've got. Um, stalls as usual, we have them here every year. Community run, organisations, people that want to sell. We've also got D106.3 here. They're actually running our stage for us and also the performance area. So we've got acts like Soundwall are back this year. We've got the folk band. We've got lots and lots of things on the stage. Performance area, we've got local cheerleaders, Morris dancers, we've got the free runners. Um, and also we've got a children's entertainer here all day. So as well as that, we've got activities such as uh, Chester City, um, youth team are here to do penalty shootouts. Uh, we have the racing toilets, we've got the rodeo sheep, we've got the bouncy castle, uh, we've got stalls from Avenue Services, also from the Adventure Playground, we've got the parade redevelopment team here, also welfare and benefit advice. But most of the things that we've got here are for everybody, for the, all the family, and uh, we hope everyone's enjoying that and the sunshine today. So a lot of organisations are influential to the festival, uh, but they work all year round to keep Blake and running. So we've got the youth groups here, we've got Avenue Services here, uh, we've got the Housing Trust, we've got Sanctuary, who are part of the Housing Trust now. Sanctuary is very keen to support the Blake and Festival, this is the first year they've supported it. Uh, they see it's a, it's a huge community event and it's something important that they wanted to get behind. The Trust is here to, um, in terms of resident involvement, we've got um, a lot of in, very involved residents and we're always looking for more um, to help us with different competitions, to scrutinise different procedures. I think this is a great festival and really important for the community. I've been the last five years and every year it's bigger and better. I think this year with um, D Radio's involvement and with more stalls and with better publicity, there seems to be more people than ever. Together, the, uh, the credit union performs a useful function for people maybe who can't get to the banks, can't get into the banks, or find for medium-sized loans, the banks are very expensive. If you want to come and just talk to one of our volunteers, to talk about whether you want to join or something like that, then we're open on Friday mornings between 10 and 12 in Avenue Services in Blaken. Well, we're here today at the Blaken Festival to promote Ch Chester Football Club. Um, as you're aware, we're very much a community club. Um, we have representatives of City Fans United here. Um, we have some of the youth team and we have our, our mascot, Lufus, of course. And we also have representatives of the Junior Blues Committee who are promoting the Junior Blues section for our younger members. Uh, and we're looking for new members and to renew members from last year. Um, and for a small charge, they become co-owners of the football club. Anybody can become a member. Um, adult membership is £12 and junior membership is £5. That money goes back into the football club, so it's, uh, it's not all about getting the team out on the pitch, it's about maintaining the club as well. There's obviously a lot of costs involved in running a football team and the higher up the leagues you go, those costs increase. Clearly a lot of people have come here today and enjoyed themselves and that's terrific. I think it's huge for the community to get together to see lots of different partner organisations working together and just to see what's on offer in, in Blake and there's a huge amount here and I, I see the area just in my time over the last five years I think it's improved drastically um, and I think that's from everyone working together, all communities working together and residents and there's a real sense of sort of positivity in this area. With it being in Blaken, it's obviously bringing the community together so this is one chance for us all to be here, all organisations, all groups, all dance troops, anything that happens in Blaken basically will come together at the Blaken Festival and showcase what Blaken's got to offer. So it is really important for Blaken just to be reminded of how much, you know, good and great effort people are putting in all year round and be able to showcase that here at the festival. So I'm glad to be a part of that.